Hey, what's going on guys? I want to talk to you about four easy ways you can start investing today in 2019 with little money, little cost setup. Now, a lot of people aren't investing because of two things, either lack of knowledge or they're afraid of high risk and they're afraid to lose their money. Now, I'm here to hopefully clear the stigma that if done correctly, you can minimize your risk while maximizing your profit. Now, let's say you only have $500 to invest right now. Where would you start? Number one would be investing in yourself, investing what's in here. Learning, learning more. You might say, well, how would I go about learning investing? There's plenty of investing books, plenty of books about business. They have tons of courses, free courses and courses to pay. Now, it all starts with knowledge. No one ever started investing without learning first, at least learning a little bit. I mean, you can jump right in with very minimum knowledge. I wouldn't do so unless you had someone right there showing you how to do it. You can also start paper trading, but we'll get to that at a different, a later video. As long as you're building up what's in here with the right information, you can't go wrong. Now, the second way to start investing today would be investing in index funds, or ETFs you might say well what is an index fund or ETF so let me break it down for you if you have $500 and you put it into let's say McDonald's all $500 into McDonald's and it goes up you might make a lot of money but if you put that same $500 into McDonald's and it goes down you might lose a lot of money but with an index fund or ETF it's about 50 plus companies all in one that you invest in. So instead of having your money in one company, you have it in, let's say, 50 or 60. So if McDonald's goes down, you have all these other companies to weigh the difference. You see what I'm saying? It's less risk, but it's also less reward. But it's a good way to start and a good way to start learning how the stock market works and all the terms and terminology and this and that. A good thing about index funds and ETFs is you have a broad spectrum of companies, mostly high cap and blue chip companies. Now the third way to start investing today in 2019 is investing in dividend stocks. Now you might ask what a dividend is. A dividend is a payment by the company just for owning a portion of that company. So if you have one share of McDonald's they'll give you a certain percentage of money back every three months. So, for example, if you put that $500 back into McDonald's and it goes up, you made money. Plus, you get a dividend every quarter or every three months. But if that stock goes down, you lose money on the stock, but you also have that dividend to fall back on. You get that dividend check. There's also something called a DRIP, a dividend reinvestment plan what it is is reinvesting the dividend back into the stock so we're compounding interest um, some brokerages do it some don't so you're gonna have to when you open up a brokerage account you're gonna have to check and see if they do that this is a guaranteed way to make money in the stock market whether the stock market goes up or down now the last way to start investing in 2019 would be to start investing in your own company in your own business now this is one of the best ways to start investing in 2019 but you're investing in yourself and you're investing in your business in the age of technology it's very easy to start a marketing business online or any type of e-commerce business you could take that five hundred dollars go to LegalZoom and get a business license then you can go to Fiverr.com get someone to make you a logo and still have about 250 bucks left over for marketing and advertising. Now this is one of the best ways to start investing because the more work you put in, the more you'll get out of it. There's no cap on to what you can make with your own business. That was four ways to start investing in 2019. If you enjoyed the content, please like and subscribe. Drop a comment and let me know if you're gonna start using one of these methods to start investing in 2019. Also, check out some of my other content on my channel and be on the lookout for new content I'm going to be dropping one video every week. I'm going to try to do two a week on investing in personal finances and self-growth. 
So thank you guys.